Indiana leads the country in meth bus. Delaware County leads Indiana in meth bus. To some, it's disheartening. To others, it's a chance to unite. Meth is not cool, like, you know, and that, that is definitely the, the message that, you know, that people, you know, the story we're telling and not, there should be no question of are we a smart city or a meth city, right? So that, that's a lot of it, just starting the conversation also that to answer that question, we're a smart city. Mike Martin used to live in Muncie. He heard about the city's meth problem through the local newspaper and returned to try to help. He created an event called Make Music Not Meth, which was designed to inspire kids to work towards art and music and turn away from drugs. Martin said the community came together to make the event happen. Moth Danner and her mother Susan helped bring Muncie's art community into the fold. She said Make Music Not Meth showed Muncie is more than drugs and crime. The goal is to show that the community cares, that there's alternatives, and specifically, as I mentioned to you earlier, that we want to show that people who are hip and cool <laughs> support not being an addict. While the event itself did not have an immediate impact on the meth numbers in Muncie, it certainly was enough to get a groove on. Tony Sandlaben for Unmasked, The Stigma of Meth.